Hey guys, welcome back to the Man Cave. I'm the UP Gamer, and we're going to play today. We're going to play on the, the ranked ladder, and today we're going to play Mono Red Aggro. Um, real straightforward deck. First thing we have is the Fanatical Firebrand. It's a one cost, one one with haste, and then you can sacrifice it to do uh, one damage to any target, which is nice. Get to Lava Runner, uh, Siobhan Fire. We got Shock in there, of course, four of those. We have two Bane Fire, and that's just a game winner for us. Um, if you have enough mana, you can cast it for um, six mana, and it can't be countered, which is great against your uh, control decks. Uh, Electrostatic Field. We have Runaway Steamkins, three of those. Uh, Viashino Pyromancer, three Lightning Strikes, four flame, or two Flame of Kelds. We have four Double Casts, just to do a bunch more damage. We got a Gutter Snipe, who can be great or you know, sometimes he just gets wiped right away, which is fine. We got a couple risk factors in there, a couple wizards lightning, and a couple direct currents. And we're just running 20 lands. It's a real fast deck. So we're going to queue up into a game here. Jump right in. Oh, yeah. Merry Christmas, by the way. Happy holidays. That's tomorrow. I did want to get a video in today and while well, every other day, too. So, yeah, we're going to jump into some aggro red and. See how we do. And, uh, yeah, that is not a great start in hand for us. Um, usually we end up with two or three lands to start. This is one, but we're not we're not going to mulligan. If we have enough, if we can draw a couple mana, this is fine. Shiv on fire may protect us, depending on what they throw out. Like that. Almost always, we're going to go face. Um, but I have Siobhan Fire in there just to stall them a little bit. Keep them from really, really slamming in hard. So, come on, draw some mana. Yep, we're going face. All right. We're not going to attack. If he attacks... We won't even block unless he throws on another creature. That one don't matter. Aha. Uh -huh. Now we're moving in the right direction. We're going to wait to play Flame of Keld a little bit just to uh, give us a chance to get through some of our cards here and then when we get low play that hopefully we can uh, draw the cards we need and then tear it up alright so what eh, I don't have enough mana so next turn I think we'll double cast and then we'll Shabon fire take up both their creatures hopefully slam home for four that is the plan. Vickland Pickland. Well, he's he's sacrificing creatures for us. Ah, he's land land screwed big time. Well, there you go. All right, my current record for this deck um, about fifty percent, um, eight and nine. I have been switching around a little bit, just messing with it, trying to get it tweaked just right. So this is the uh, current iteration is the best that it's been. But it is still streaky. It's kind of all over the place. Jump into another one here. All right. Who are we playing this time? Ralky. Yeah, and you can see I'm at gold tier two now. Moving on up again with the with single land. This time we do have some singles that we can play. We're gonna keep it. We don't need this is a very mana light deck. There we go. And 
and slamming in for one damage. Yeah, slamming in for one damage. Really, really powerfully. I'm going to do that, and then we're just going to kill his, his Healer Hawk. We don't need them gaining life. That is, that is the nemesis of this deck. Yeah, I've been having a lot of fun. I had a lot of fun with that Amazonian's uh, Play Anything draft. That was a good time for sure. And Steamkin might just get smoked, but got to play it. Because if we can get it rolling, it's it's tough for them to beat. He looks confused. All right. We're going to get him out. More damage. Definitely not attacking with our Steamkin. That's not a big deal. I mean, it can be a big deal, but at the moment it's not a huge deal. See, I would much rather have one more mana than I can double. But we're just going to shoot. Never mind. We can't shock. It is a big deal. I lied. Yep, I need mana. Yeah, I played like 16 games of this before you before I get online and then uh, didn't have man dish, land issues one time. Now I do. Yep, we need land soon. No, we do not block. That's great and all. But no, we're not attacking. Do 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 do. Yay! We did it. We have land. And so we can do that costs two. That'll get the steam can to four. We shock on Shala. Double cast does two more, that's four, and then we can direct current with the three mana we get from Steamkin. There's four damage. And there we go. Get our three mana back. All right. And Sh Shalai is dead. We are still not attacking.
this might hurt. And that's going to be game. Shalai was a, a problem for us almost as much as mana. So we're out of this one. We'll play one more. There you go. You can see I'm gold tier two there. And we'll play one more. Maybe this one, the guy will stay in. Maybe we'll have enough mana. Phoenix. I think you spelled it wrong. Aha, we have mana. And we're just going to go right to face. Vidalian Arcanist. As you can see, this deck's pretty straightforward. Past, uh, cast your creatures, slam home, go face, take out their uh, defenders with uh, Siobhan Fire if you need to, and just keep rolling. If you get enough mana, <coughs> you can definitely win quickly. folks we're not going to block we're not worried about one damage yeah now we have a lot of land one second here all right we don't want to discard our hand So we're gonna we're gonna direct current. We don't want to discard our hand yet. Um, do we want to attack? We're gonna hold off. We may need to block. Flame of Keld, if you can hit it right, you can do it can be very, very useful. That's what that does. You discard your cards. Uh, you discard your hand, draw two cards on the on the next uh, part of the saga, and then if a red source would deal damage to a permanent or player this turn, it deals that much plus two. Five. Again, we're not worried about that yet. Yeah, and then next turn we're gonna we're gonna flame of Keld. I think this turn we're gonna block. Uh, we could attack, but we need to we need to stop some damage now. He's got seven out there. And when we draw with Flame of Keld, we need some we need some damage cards. <coughs> so
So we're going to do direct current. We're going to get rid of our mountain and then we'll play uh, Flame of Keld. I love the art on this card. It's pretty cool looking. Discard your hand. Sure thing. I'm surprised he didn't attack last turn. I will not be attacking. He's counting something. Well, there you go. That would be why he did not attack. Well, and there you go. That would be game. 5, 10, 15. No, oh, 4, 12? Ooh. Yeah, I need something now. Draw me something good. <laughs> Not good enough. All right, so if this had been possibly a Lightning Bolt, Lightning Bolt, we would have got Put Gutter Snipe down, and then if we had Wizards uh, Lightning, it's one to cost or one to cast, so we could have did Gutter Snipe down, cast Double Cast, that's two to the face, then cast Wizards Retort. <coughs> when you cast that, that does three. Gutter Snipe does two, so that's from five to three. And the double cast from the last one puts it down, but we didn't get that. That's a loss, guys. Thanks for stopping by to the man cave. Um, that's all we're going to do today. I'm going to switch it up, play a different deck. Um, I will be making a video tomorrow. I'm not sure what time, but I'm on vacation. So I'm going to be posting some more. Other than that, Merry Christmas. Thanks for coming by. Um, that's it. Thanks. Have a good day, guys.